Disclaimer, the potential clips used in this video is being used under the Fair Use Act of Section 107. These clips are being used primarily for comedial effect. No monetary gain is being made from these. All rights are reserved and the clips belong to their original owners. Thank you and enjoy. Alright folks, welcome back to the madness. Right, so uh, now that we've wrapped up our business here in 600 AD, we need to get back to where we were. Oh, I didn't go over uh, Mal's equipment, did I? No, I didn't. Uh, we'll do it after this fight. Mods belong. Okay. Oh, so anyway, just gotta clear these rolly riders up. <laughs> rolly riders, I love it. Alright, so... Let's go over Mal's equipment. I forgot to do that at the beginning. Sorry. There we go. We learned Slash our first line technique, I believe it is. Something like that. Anyway, let's have a look at Mal. So Mal is another ranged character. Obviously has the element of water, like Frog is. But what you'll find the difference between Mal and Frog, Mal tends to have more ice-based spells, where Frog will have more water-based. So, as I was mentioning, I'm um, sorry about that. Uh, so, as I was mentioning, uh, Marl tends to have more iced based um, spells, where Frog will have more water based. It's, it's a weird thing the two of them have got going on. It's really weird. But anyway, so she's kind of the healer of the game. So, she'll learn a good bit of ice spells and healing spells. Pretty decent party member for the, the game itself. It's not bad, actually. Right, so let's see if we can give her some. Yeah, give her a karate gi actually. Uh, hand me down from Daffy himself. And we do have a ribbon, but I don't know what the ribbon does. The ribbon. Strike plus. Ah, okay, strike plus two. So that's the hits. That's the hits thing. Okay. Um. Ribbon. I didn't think ribbon did that. I thought ribbon was something else. Right, well, to be honest, I feel like giving her the defender since she has the lowest HP at right now. So the extra two points of defense would be really nice to use. Also, in terms of sex, she, she's going to learn Aura, which is our basic healing spell, which is pretty nice. So anyway, apart from that, let's carry on. So what we need to do is now, we need to get back to that warp gate, uh, which we first appeared in in part two. So it shouldn't be, uh, should be, should be that long to be extremely honest. So uh, I think I mentioned the dual tech for Luca in the last session, um, seeing that there's a level 2 tech that is really, really good. And she gets Aura, nice. And we get Aura Whirl, which is our AOE ability. Uh, dual wield, a dual wield? Uh, dual tech between Chrono and Luffy. Luffy, fucking Mal. I don't know why I said Luffy then, fucking hell. Must be thinking of One Piece. So, let's get back up. So, um, what was I saying? I don't know. Yeah, well, we'll have to get back up here anyway. Truce Canyon, and then we're back to the gates, and then we can carry on with the story. Hopefully the king doesn't execute us for taking the daughter, maybe. <laughs> God. Oh, speaking of which, we need to do a bit of healing. Oh, excuse my throat. I'll clear it up in a second, so let me do a spell first. God, this is one ton of This is one tough son of a bitch. Waste of time. Right, should be able to fish off the imp in one go. Cool. Awesome. Right, I'll be a second. Right, okay, sorry about that. Just clear my throat. Obviously, you don't want to hear a big. Uh, that's green, do you? Alright, I think we'll have to go this way. Yep. Here's the gate home. How do we get home? Uh, your highness, uh, princess, we... Please call me Mal. Well then, Mal, um, observe. Wow! Luca, you're amazing. Ain't it the truth? 
Oh, um, I mean... Enough with the false modesty. You have a real gift. I would trade my royal ancestry for your genius in a heartbeat. Well, if you say so. Anyway, I call this thing a gate. It's the kind of portal that takes you to the same location in a different era. Gates are very unstable, so I use the principle behind my telepod device to create a gate key. Now we can use them as we please. But why did this gate suddenly appear? Either the telepod has something to do with it, or something else made it. This is getting pretty weird. Let's at least head back to our own time. Alright, coming, Daffy? Yep. Yeah, come on. Do 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 do. <laughs> Back where it all started. Nice. Phew, we're back. Daffy, Luca, why don't you come with me home to the castle? I'd like to come over for dinner. Sorry for putting you through all that, Mal. Are you joking? That's the most fun I had in months! And I had new friends too. Daffy, be a gentleman and take her home. I got some work to do. Alright. See you soon, Luca. Right, well. Will you escort me home, Daffy? Escort me home? Yeah, sure. Me? Oh! Oh, shit. <laughs> I didn't think you could do that. I thought maybe a bit of a uh, text box would come up. Alright, I did actually think you could go back in time. Never tried it. I never thought there was a. Um, I never thought there was a reason, but. Oh well. Let's just try it out. Well, anyway, I hope you're gonna like seeing that cutscene because you're gonna see a lot of it during this game. <laughs> I can tell you that now. Okay, right. Well, I better make you aware. Do you remember the things I told you to do or not to do around here? Well, that's going to come into effect very, very soon. Anyway, buy something from Melchior to source beef? Sure, because I want to show you that there was no point in buying an iron blade because we got a stronger sword, and there's no point in buying the Lord Sword because we're going to be getting that soon. Yeah. Uh, by the way, could you tell that young lady to sell on her pendant? No. I believe that's another negative thing as well. So if we click no, we should be alright. Right, anyway, let's get to Gallia Castle. So just the same way as before. And you may notice we don't have like a cathedral on this time, do we? No, we don't. Um, I believe there's um, enemies in Gallia Forest. What's my healing like? He's shocking. Right then, let's go to the home. Oh no, that's not our home. Where's, where's our home? Our home is... Okay, it's, it's here somewhere. Fuck, where's the house? Isn't it? There we go. And the reason why is because we could get now in our bed. Oh. <laughs> nah, you can rest up here for free, which is pretty nice. <laughs> I was half expecting the mother to come to the bottom of the stairs with an optional cutscene saying what you're doing up there with her. You slam dot, you sly dog. <laughs> right, anyway. Guardia Forest. Right, so pretty much the same path, I believe. I think there is some treasure around here if we need, if we have a look. Let's have a look. We've got some optional monsters to see we can face. Some fucking toadstools. Hitake mushrooms. Yeah, these guys should be uh, weak cash. So we'll blitz through these, no problem. Oh, nice crit. Should be enough. Yeah, it's nice. Okay, nice big slash. 118 crit. Beautiful. Okay, 9, 3, and 4, yeah, gold and tonic. Nice. Yeah, uh, you're gonna get a lot of items. Aha. Uh -huh. What have we got? We got Power Tap. Real. So that's another one for a certain party member later on in the game. Um, da, 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 da. Just gonna see if. I'm sure there's another treasure out here somewhere. I'm sure there is. Right, let's see if I can use Cyclone actually on the top two. Ah, oh, yeah, we can use Cyclone. Awesome. Saves a bit of time. I'll kill two of them. Pop. Pop. 
Unless even Mal can finish this guy off. Yeah, alright, cool. So she doesn't need a crit to uh, kill him. I mean, I've not used any tonics yet, and I've already got nine. That's pretty cool, actually. Although I guarantee we'll be using them in the far future anyway. Ah, uh, right, I guess there's another fight here. And who have we got to fight? Some stag beetle things. Beetle and avian chaos. That should be enough to one problem. Is that enough for your mal? Uh, it is actually. Nice. Okay, one more attack. There we go. So yeah, for the most part, battles are pretty quick in Grotria. It's just the bosses that take a bit of time. But I'm still going to try and fight every fight, if possible. Because it just tallies up the experience. Seems in the grinding, and more importantly, you get set points as well. So you can get better techniques. Not to mention there's a star that getting some items as well, which will save a bit of money in the long run. Okay, nice. Experience 3 points, 48, 1 tonic. Okay, uh, no, let's not go that way just yet. Alright, I'm going to save the game and I will see you in a second. Okay, we're back. Let's go see what's going to happen. Princess Nadia! Ah. Are you alright? Where have you been? I heard you were abducted. We had soldiers searching for you. Scoundrel, you're the one, huh? Kidnapping Princess Nadia? No, a deafies. Admit it. You got your to and take, try to take over the throne. Terrorist. <laughs> Terrorist, fucking hell. I keep getting fucking 90s uh, SNES games in terms of the text weren't exactly, you know, clear cut or censored as it is nowadays. <laughs> so stop it. Uh oh, we're getting surrounded. Stop this at once! Also, by the way, I'm gonna have to try and keep my voice down as well. So that's why I'm not going over the top with the voice acts in this time. What are you doing? Princess Nadia said to. Hit it! Detain him! Now, this is what I mean by the actions, you know, the positive and negative triggers. Because now we're on trial. This should be fun. I'm the Chancellor, the Prosecutor. And the lawyer, Pierre. Members of the court. We now bring forth the defendant, Deffy, who is charged with abducting Princess Nadia. Oh, this is fun. We're on court. We're on trial. <laughs> I plead the fifth. <laughs> what shall we do with him? Fire, perhaps? Hang him upside down for a few years? Or shall we employ the guillotine? You, the jury, shall decide his fate. Now, let us begin. Deffy, you are hereby ordered to tell the truth. Deffy is charged with premeditated abduction of royalty. The question ails, did he kidnap Princess Nadia? The answer? No, he did not. In fact, no abduction took place. The two met completely by accident. In fact, the princess asked Daffy if she could join him. Is this true? Who actually started the whole mess? Uh, I believe... I did. Just as I suspected. The defendant deliberately tried to get near the princess. Yeah. Hey! Ouch, that hurt! Let's try to think. The princess then incidentally followed you to Lucas' little sideshow, whereupon you both disappeared. If that wasn't a criminal abduction, I don't know what is. And I have the facts to throw the defendant's character into question. Objection. Objection! Well, this can't have any relevance whatsoever to this case. 
Get to respond, Chancellor. Deathly's character is at the very core of this case. We have nothing to hide. The issue here is motive. Was there any motive for this fine citizen to kidnap Princess Nadia? No, there was none. What about Ransom? Deffy, her fortune did not tempt you, did it not? No. Are you sure you wasn't tempted at all? Mm, just a bit. I think I said just a bit, right? Uh, I'm trying to think. Not at all, just a bit. Nah, no, not at all. That's enough. I've got more questions. It is evident that my client is a fine and noble young man, Your Honor. The defense rests. So this is the important bit. Members of the jury, if he is guilty, stand to the left. If innocent, stand to the right. Alright, so this should be so this could be interesting. Not guilty. Oh that's two for not guilty. Not guilty. Not guilty. Not guilty. Not guilty. Yay, <laughs> clean sweep. Not guilty. At least I think it is. I think there's always one that goes guilty, I think. No, we got the clean sweep. Holy shit. Not guilty. Oh, dude, that's awesome. Order in the court. A verdict has been reached. The verdict is not guilty. But the fact remains that even if he did not kidnap her, he ran off with her. Three days solitary confinement as punishment. Take him away. Alright, yep. Now, just a darn minute. Princess. That's enough, my dear. All I asked for you was to behave like a princess. Even royalty must obey rules. Leave the rest up to the Chancellor and forget about the events in town. We're leaving. Yep. Duffy! Now, we should be able to get items now, which would be pretty cool. Also, there is two ways of doing this next bit as well. So I'll explain the two progressive progressions in a second, but I'll do the one that I've always been, which I found the best to be honest. This terrorist has tried to overthrow our kingdom. He has been found guilty, and you must now carry out his sentence. So this is the monster who kidnapped the princess. The execution is in three days away. Do not let him out of your sight. Execution? <laughs> Strange. I seem to recall hearing anything about an execution. What? How dare you question me? The paperwork's probably just been held up in the system. Uh, understood, sir. Guards. Take the prisoner away. And... clink. <laughs> Not tight. Yep. We're in a cell. We're in a cell. Okay, now, um, there are two ways to progress out here now. First of all, you can wait the three days. You don't have to do anything, you just wait. Or you can go to the gates and cause a commotion and break out. Personally, I would recommend waiting the three days. I mean, it's not exactly going to go as you think it is going to go. I mean, Crisis of JRPG is a kid's game. It's not going to end with the main character with his head off. So, we're going to wait for three days. But what I'm going to do is, I'm going to do a quick save. I'll be with you in a bit. It's in a sec. Okay, we're back. Pipe down. See, that's what you do. Anyway, here's our items. Some sympathizers brought that stuff from you, you lousy felon. So yeah, we just get some stuff. Got one ether. Oh, I got more than that before. Huh, I wonder if it's to do with, yeah, 
is what to do around town. That's what it is. Anyway, here. HP and MP recovered. That's fine. Right, so we're just going to sit tight and wait for the three days to pass. So yeah, I guess you do have to do everything then to get the items. Because we just got an ether and you can get a lot more than that. Alright, I guess I missed that point then. Oh well, it doesn't matter. An ether's better than nothing anyway. Alright, well, I guess it's the end of the playthrough. Might as well see this through and all up to our crimes and confess. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching today's video. Please leave a like if you enjoyed it, subscribe if you're new and interested in the videos, and leave a comment, what's your favourite part of the video, I would love to know. There are links if you're interested, one to my most recent upload if you would love to see what I'm currently doing, one to the playlist if you want to catch up or watch from the beginning, and finally one to the channel to browse my other videos. Whatever you choose, please have a great day, and I hope to see you soon. Bye for now.